I'm Coach Mike Gossel. I'm with Coach Tight Ends and Fullback. Today I'm going to take you inside Tribe Football. We're coming to work you today. We're coming to work you today. Especially this guy. 9 0 all day. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, going to take all these. Hey, we're going to do today. What are we going to do today? Dominate. I don't know. Dominate. Dominate. I like that. Got to be sharp. Effort and concentration today. Effort and concentration. Go. Eyes ahead. There you go. Get through there, Levi. Get through there. High knees through there. High knees through. Okay. Plant change direction. Come back. Come back to the opposite one. Okay. Quick feet. Got it. Go. Get through there. Get through there. Get through there. Finish. Finish through me. Finish through me. Got to be excellent. Got to be excellent. Got to be excellent. Yeah. We're at 19. Hey. Stay on track. Stay on track. Great. Hey. Again, checking that knee. That knee disappears. Boom. I'm climbing with my eyes. I don't leave. But I'm climbing with my eyes, see what's in front of you. Here we go. Gotta be violent, check, fellas. Check. Check. Gotta be Red violent. 18. Let's go. Red 18. Hike, hike, check. Blue 11. Uh -huh. Blue 11. Hike. Let's go. Let's go. Base. Base. Hey, keep your base at all times. Keep your base at all times. Stay in that good demeanor. Drive that second step. Ah, keep your eyes there. Hey, you gotta get your eyes there right now. Okay? You already got leverage. Keep it. Keep it, right? Now you let him cross, that's tough. Now you're playing catch up. Right away. Well, I'm still square. I'm still square and I'm going. My head's got to be inside. Sharp and focused. Sharp and focused. Eyes. Turn it up. Good. Got to score. Got to score. That's better. That's what I'm talking about. Good. I think the, you know, the, bi the biggest thing with our group right now, the thing that I harp on every day is effort and concentration. We're making sure these guys are focused, got the laser lock kind of concentrations that we get out here, we understand that every rep we have, every rep that we take, okay, no matter what the period or the emphasis is or the situation, that everything's kind of siphon us towards success. You know, understand that everything affects whether we're successful or we fail. So, you know, getting those guys to really buy into that concept of effort and concentration really has helped. I've seen a lot from them, you know, so far this camp. Nolan has a lot of experience. You know, he's played for us the last two years, um, you know, and made a significant contribution, you know. So he, he is a veteran who's had a lot of time. He's, he's done an excellent job. And I think, you know, even, even the transition I've seen in him from springtime till now has been incredible. He's really done a great job of, you know, just really training hard in the offseason, really kind of really focusing up a little bit and taking over that role. You know, losing Gottlieb. Gottlieb's a great player, great guy. You know, obviously he's in the NFL now, you know, so we had good success with him. But I think Nolan, no one can bring some things to the table as well. He's athletic. He has great size. He has great strength. Okay, he's an effective blocker. At the same time, he'll get out there and he can make some people miss. He's he, he's he's athletic, so he can he can be a weapon in the pass game too. Yeah, I think right now, you know. After Nolan, we got Bo Revel, who's done a great job. You know, we brought him in as a quarterback early, and he's you know spent the last two years as a tight end. He he has really come a long, long way. Big body kid, 6'6", 262, You know, is kind of kind of coming into his own a little bit. You know, doing a great job. Did a great job in the weight room. That's one of his biggest strengths. Is you know his work ethic. You know, his, his the way he gets after it a little bit, and uh, you know he brings that on the field as well. He's turned into a more dominant blocker. He's he's showing that he can be effective even with that big body. You know, being 6'6", six, six, that's a matchup nightmare out there in space. And, you know, he, he's athletic enough to make some things happen. They got Rob Asmar behind him, he's doing a great job. You know, he, uh, he's a guy that who can really do a lot of things in space. He's very athletic, has great hands, great hands. You throw it to him, he's catching it. If it's, if it's anywhere in the frame of his body where he can get a hand on, he's bringing it down. So, you know, and then we got Evan McGill, a young guy who's really making a nice push here, um, you know, getting better. You know, played a little, he was a tight end, but was flexed out a lot in high school, didn't do much on the line stuff so that's been a learning curve but I tell you he, he's definitely made some significant progress even since spring. TJ brings you know a, a toughness element to some things you know he, he uh, he's he works so hard in the weight room does a great job there um, you know and he's kind of one of those quiet leaders tremendous work ethic works really hard um, you know he, he'll he'll do a nice job for us this fall uh, got Andrew Widinger behind him or you know kind of with him actually uh, who's doing a great job you know he was a line, we brought him in as a linebacker switched him over in the spring I love his mentality love his effort you know he's one of those guys that come out and he'll, he'll go through a brick wall for you that's kind of what we're looking for and we've got some young guys behind him Levi Cohen does a great job um, he's getting out there he's really working hard did a good job this summer uh, Alex Tremblay you know he's doing good for us and we brought in Joe Palangi incoming freshman who you know we're looking to see some big things from him as well 
home front is great. Home front is great. I got a great wife, you know. She, uh, it's kind of interesting. We got, we got a new house, new baby, and then we went right into training camp. So it's kind of, you know, a lot of transition in one, but she's a, she's a great woman. You know, she's able to handle that stuff. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm blessed to have her at my side. And, you know, the baby's doing great. My little two-year-old, you know, making that little adjustment. It's working out pretty good. So she loves her little baby sister. So all, all is good on the home front. I'd like to say hello to my wife, Nikki, and uh, my daughter, Kaylee, and my brand-new baby girl, Evie.